Ryan Stonekert with Junior Aaron Lynn Kogel. I should mention Aaron is the president-elect of the student body at Rich High School. Aaron, thanks for your time. Thank you for having me. Why did you decide to run for student body? Uh, I think it would just be a fun activity to just you know be more involved with the school and all the students and try to be more open with you know friendships and everything. Have make everyone have a more fun year. Had you done any student body officers or government in the past? I'm part of honor society, but that's only really big kind of leadership kind of thing and be an example to all the other students. But this is going to be a little new for me. Now, they ran it a little differently this year, right? It was just you chose to run, and whoever got the most votes was president, second most was vice president, right? Mm-hmm, for sure, yeah. So what did you run on? What was your campaign or your slogan, or what did you do? I kind of just went for it and did a little few random things. But, yeah, I mean, it was it was a little new for me. I didn't really like the new way that they did it, but, you know, what's done is done. So you got to work with what you have. <laughs> Were you thinking you'd done for like VP or secretary or something else? Um, I was going for president if they didn't have ch- didn't change the rules, but yeah. So you're happy about the, becoming the president? Yeah, I'm, I'm excited. What do you know that you'll need to do over the course of the next year? Uh, I just know I need to work hard just like every other president has in the past, but it's going to be a fun year. Um, try to do new, more new things and have more activities so more students can get involved and everyone is a part of, you know, one school. We're all just one big family, so... Did you promise uh, like new vending machines in the lunchroom or I mean, what, like, what did you, how did you get elected? Really? Well, my mom danced for the kids. So, I mean, <laughs> it was kind of a funny skit, but <laughs> you had uh, your own Napoleon Dynamite come out and dance for you. Oh, well, that was, that was Daniel Gifford. But me, I just had my mom come over and everyone loves my mom. I mean, get the parents involved and everything too with the school and not just all the kids, but yeah. So you said you you need to work hard. Are there things that you want to do maybe a little differently or things that you hope to achieve next year? I just want to get everyone involved because usually there's always people who are left out in the school and just all those kids who feel a little bit lonely, but I mean, do activities that everyone can feel like they're part of the team, I guess. So, Aaron, I know you're um, pretty talented, like gifted uh, theatrically, right? You did the musical, the singing, you do a lot of that kind of stuff. What else are you into? I just like being involved with all the kids over here. I'm not really much of a big sports guy, but, you know, just give more time to being president is going to help me with that. So at least the last three presidents have been big sports guys this year. That's ending right now. Nick Wallentine, Mitch Jarman the year before that and Lincoln Huffner before that. You feel like you'll be able to bring a new perspective to the student body office, the government, being not being a sports guy. Yeah, especially for those kids who aren't really involved in all the sports. And just, I mean, I'm still friends with all the people who are in sports. So, you know, get everyone involved this time, too. So I don't know if it's a unique situation because there are a lot of other small schools around the country and even around the state. But uh, it certainly is a, a special thing to have a smaller community. And like you said, you're like a big family. Yeah, for sure. We're all just, we all know each other. We all know everyone's names. And I mean, it's better that sometimes people don't know who everyone is. And I mean, it should, it should feel like one big family because, you know, everyone's just united in the school. And so. President Aaron, is there anything else we should touch on? Um, I think, I think we covered everything. Yeah. It's going to be a fun year next year. So. President-elect Aaron Lynn Kogel at Rich High School, congratulations on winning the election and uh, best of luck becoming president and everything you got going in your senior year next year. Sweet. Thank you so much.